Hey, you want to do a whiskey quickie? Come on, get ready. Hey everybody, this is Mark from Northwest Bourbon. Thank you so much for joining us. Tonight we're going to talk about some Jim Beam, which we haven't done very much on this channel. Well, a couple months ago I was at the PX on base and I found this Jim Beam Signature Craft. 12 year old age stated 86 proof and I had never seen it before and I was like well it's $40 out the door and the usual Jim Beams that I've gotten from base like the double oak I thought those ones were pretty good I'm not a big fan of the white label but when I saw this one sitting on the shelf with the 12 year age statement I thought ah, it's only 86 proof but it's only 40 bucks out the door so I'm gonna give it a try and so I had it in my kitchen and every once in a while I'd go for a sip of it and I started to notice it's one of the best Jim Beams I've ever had and so I kept going back in it and still hadn't done a review so now we're finally getting to it now that there's only 20% of it left all right so let's get into it all right, so like I said, it's got a 12 year age statement, 86 proof, Kentucky Straight Bourbon Whiskey Jim Beam Signature Craft. And it's got a much differently shaped bottle than the regular Jim Beams that I've had. So I'm just gonna do a real fast whiskey quickie with you and tell you what I think. Lots of caramel covered oak. If you really dig down deep in there, there's some fruit note in there. I don't know if it's like a cherry skin or what, but you have to get really deep because all you smell up top is caramel and wood. As you can see, it's got a nice color to it. Let's get into the palette, cheers. Lots of vanilla and caramel sweetness right up front, like the aftertaste of a candy bar, like a, like a Milky Way. Uh, got a real Milky Way flavor. Not heavy on the chocolate though. But there is some chocolate in there but that nougat that's in milky way i don't know what that stuff is i know it's got to be bad for you but all right my palate has kind of acclimated a little bit more to the gym beam picking up some more wood notes a little bit of char but not very much it's real subtle a lot of vanilla sweetness almost like a vanilla creamer like that you would use for your coffee it's got a really nice like kind of deep dark but well balanced flavor profile to it no wonder it was disappearing so fast when i had it in the kitchen man this is some good stuff like i said i found this for 40 dollars out the door and if i can find it again i'm definitely gonna buy it again when i looked online there was a lot of variance in prices per website of how much they were selling this for everywhere from 40 dollars to $115 so be careful because it's not a $115 bottle especially at 86 proof but if you can find it south of 50 pick it up so guys thank you for joining me on this whiskey quickie remember to like comment and subscribe earn protect enjoy cheers